Okay, so now I am going to make a um, spaghetti sauce. And the way that I do it, I have a... I do it very, very... It's very, very simple. I throw everything in whole. I got a couple carrots in there. I might add a couple after. Um, right now I'll show you what I have. Uh, just grab them, some things from the fridge. I have some garlic, which I will probably put like a whole... Like a whole one of these... All together in there. Look, we love it garlicky. And then I had a couple peppers left over, some little baby peppers. Uh, I'm gonna use those up. And I also have a green pepper here that's starting to wilt. And I just cut my pieces into great big pieces. I clean, wash my my vegetables really good. Throw everything in there, and I'm gonna turn it on medium just to kind of get the veggies. Um, soft, very soft, and then I'll add my sauce, and anyways, I'll bring you guys along, uh, I don't know if I've ever vlogged my spaghetti sauce before, but I will show you how simple it is, uh, I, I guess you could say it's kind of different every time, because I don't measure, I just kind of go with the flow, you know, so, uh, but you guys can come along, and if you just want to guess how much I'm putting in, then, um, but I'll show you guys everything. And then I have some onions that I have to obviously use up. I have this one. I want to put about two onions in and see how good that is. And I'm using my great big roasting pan for today because I need uh, a lot. And I might also get out one of my big pots because I need to make a lot of spaghetti sauce. Um, I also have... This is my new stalk of celery. I just kind of forgot to take it out of the fridge. But I have a stalk of celery... That's, it's not in bad shape or nothing, but I'm going to use that up. Um, maybe not the whole thing because I have a veggie tray that I'm going to make up. So maybe I'll just cut the whole thing up, clean it, throw most of it in here, but fill up the veggie tray. And then I have some mushrooms that I'm going to throw in that are starting to go bad. I'm just going to wash those up. And then if I need any more, I'll use some from this pack here. Sorry, you guys are getting blurry. Um... And then I'll probably throw in some green onions. I'll cut that and then I'll just stick this in some water. And then, of course, I've got a ton of spices. Uh, I can't even begin, in, begin to name them all. Um, I'm going to put some... This is... You can use whatever salt you want. I just... This is my salt that I use here. I have some salt. And I'm going to put some parsley. And some pepper, of course. Uh, probably a little bit of garlic powder. And then, oh, I've got all kinds of all kinds of things. I have some oregano. You can't have spaghetti sauce without oregano. And oh my goodness, that is something we have to add to the list. I'm gonna go write that down. But some oregano and yeah, some celery salt. Just a little bit. I don't like to add too much salt. Um, and yeah, maybe a little bit of... Just a little bit of turmeric. And yeah, just some random other spices I have kicking around. But, uh, like I said, I'll bring you guys along with me. So right now I'm just going to go wash and prep my vegetables. I'll put them in the pan really nicely so that... Um, you guys can see what it looks like. This is, and then I've got my garlic, my green onions, my celery, and then yeah, I, so this is basically it. And I might cut up some more carrots because I have to cut some up for the veggie tray. So cut some up, throw them in there, and my um, it's gonna be jam packed with vegetables. And then I use my little hand mixer thing. It blends everything up so smooth. You don't even know what is in there. And everybody loves it. So, And then um, I could add, you know, like um, if I had some spinach and things like that and broccoli and all that type of thing. You could add all that in, grind that up. You don't even see it. And then um, for meat, because this is like a kind of a vegetarian one, I guess you could say, uh vegan even um, you could fry up some hamburger throw it in maybe I'll make kind of uh, half and half I'll do one with no 
a hamburger and one with hamburger or whatever but just because I have some uh, lasagnas as well to make so I'm just gonna try to prep everything at once but I'm gonna show you guys my spaghetti recipe so um, I'm gonna quit blobbing and go get some vegetables washed cut and like I said I'm gonna arrange them in here all nice for you guys so that I can show you guys uh, exactly how many how much vegetables are going in and I'm gonna get out another pot so I'll be right back okay so I just finished chopping up all my vegetables <coughs> excuse me um, let's see if I can do this with a spoon uh, I got a ton of mushrooms all on this side like it goes down there's a ton of them I did a pack plus some out of the other one and then I did a bunch of carrots bunch a bunch of celery that's all celery there's some green pepper down there that was the green pepper that I showed you guys uh, there's onions uh, my celery I didn't even take the leaves off because that has flavor as well I got onions and red peppers and then I have some green onions down there so um, what I'm gonna do now is uh, I may or may not um, cook these up because I have to run into town for a bit. But um, I'm going to leave these here. And when I come back, I will like simmer them, simmer them up. And just to cook them to get them like nice and uh, tender like I was saying. And then I'm going to throw in my tomato, tomatoes and tomato sauce and all that stuff to, to make it all saucy. And then I will grind that all up with my hand grinder uh, hand blender at the very end and I'm going to have a nice smooth um, spaghetti sauce which is exactly how I love it the only thing I have not done yet is put the uh, spices in and I still have my garlic to cut up but I consider that kind of like a spice I guess so um, yeah so I'm going to cover this and I will be back and whenever I be whenever I come back I will um, have turned this on just to get my vegetables nice and simmered up and you'll see what it looks like. Okay so I'm just kind of like boiling it down, steaming it. Uh, okay so um, I'm just going to go ahead and add some of the spices now. I already added, um, I just had a couple different things on here and I had some of this garden select. Um, I had a big bottle, I don't even know what it is right now, it was a big bottle of uh, ragu, I think, and then I'm gonna, so basically right now I just, is, this is my hand grinder thing that I'll blender, I'm just gonna go ahead and blend it up, and then I'm gonna see how thick or thin it is, and if I need to add more uh, tomatoes, because I, I didn't even add any tomatoes or anything yet, and it didn't really make all that much um, sauce but I'm gonna see I'll get together my uh, lasagnas and then uh, I'll know if I have to make some more spaghetti sauce or not or if I should add more vegetables uh, and so on so I'm gonna go ahead and get this all smoothed out I won't bore you with it but uh, I'll be right back and whenever it's grinded up 